What's up cooks, it's Wednesday. So a couple months ago, we posted a video about our recent trip to the Lodge factory store in Pigeon Forge, Tennessee. We had a fantastic time going through the store, looking at all the great Lodge products, their cast iron, all their accessories. We came home with a basket full of stuff. And um, I became good friends with one of the managers there. His name is Harold. And Harold reached out to me and sent me a box of one of their brand new cast iron lines called Blacklock. And what's so special about this is it is named after the original foundry of the company that burnt down years and years ago. The company later became Lodge. So we have a couple pieces of the new Blacklock cast iron straight from the Pigeon Forge Lodge factory outlet store. So we're gonna take a look at these and we are gonna have a little bit of fun cooking on these. So what's up, it's Wednesday. Let's look at the Lodge Blacklock cast iron. So when I think of a cast iron skillet, the first thing that comes to mind is Lodge, right? Lodge has been around for a long time. They are a classic American company that makes their cast iron right here in the US. Now, um, when we were bebopping down through Tennessee, we happened to stop at a town called Pigeon Forge and I had never been down there before. And we rode down the main strip through there and we were amazed at everything that's in Pigeon Forge. It's sort of like the Vegas version of uh, Tennessee without the gambling, right? They have Dolly World, they have tons of fa uh, factory outlets. And one of the things we found, as soon as I saw that name on the side of that store that said Lodge Factory Store, we headed straight in there. So we met the nicest people in that store. And um, if you're interested in taking a look at any of Lodge's cookware, you can give them a call. I'll put a, th their name, their name, phone number, and address down in the description. You can call up and ask for Harold and ask whatever kind of questions you have about Cast Iron, about Lodge, about any other product they have in the store. They had tons of stuff in the store. I mean, you can order directly from them and have it shipped to your house. So um, one of the things I can say is the people in that store are very, very, um, they love cookware, they love kitchen gadgets, and they can answer all your questions about any of the Lodge products, as well as, you know, how to use, how to cook in them, whatever you want to know about cast iron, they know it. So they were so kind as to send this box of cookware, and I don't know what's in here. I haven't opened this yet. All I did was get this box. Now, a lot of stores have been closed because of the, um, the stay at home orders, but they have reopened back up. So if you want to talk to them about cast iron, give them a call, they are open, right? Lodge's original um, foundry was called Blacklock. And unfortunately it burned down and they retooled, built a new factory and changed their name to Lodge. And now they have come out with a premium line of cast iron to look back through their history. So not only is it named after their original foundry, but it has little elements in there um, that, that give homage to their history. One of the things they've done with this line of cookware is they've made it 25% lighter, which has been one of the complaints about cast iron, the weight of it. So if you are concerned about, you know, I don't want to get a cast iron skillet because it's too heavy. Well, Lodge has managed to formulate the um, iron that's in this so it is lighter. Also, it has a premium coating on it. It's triple seasoned. 
So there's so many things about the black lock line that people that are new to cast iron or they haven't used their cast iron a lot because of the maintenance that the black lock line um, solves. Not only is it a little bit lighter, but it's triple season, so it's a lot easier to take care of. Um, so I'm ready to get this box open. It's been sitting here in my entryway for a couple weeks. I don't know what's in here, and um, I'm looking forward to seeing this uh, new, new line of cast iron. I just wanna take this opportunity to thank the Pigeon Forge Lodge factory, factory store and for sending this. If you want to talk to them about cast iron or you want to place an order, I'll leave their phone number and their address down below um, so you can talk to them directly. You can call them and even ask for Harold. So let's get this baby open and um, see what's in here. Cheers, everyone. It's Wednesday. <laughs> so let's see what's in this box. I'm excited because I haven't seen this line and I actually don't know what's in this box. So. Yeah. Ooh, this is gonna be so good camping. Sweet! Oh, yeah. Blacklock, sweet. Yeah. South Pittsburgh, Tennessee, the original Lodge Foundry. Oh my God, this is beautiful. Wow. When Joseph Lodge built the Black Lock Foundry in 1896, each piece of cast iron cookware was carefully poured by hand into a thin design for the ultimate culinary experience. Now, over 120 years later, the Lodge cast iron family proudly debuts a new revolutionary line named after the original foundry. This Black Lock Dutch oven not only models the thin, lightweight design of its namesake, it celebrates the latest innov innovation in cast iron history, a triple season finish. Sweet. This is beautiful. Woo. Wow. Oh, look at that, guys. Woo. So what we have here is a 12 inch triple season cast iron skillet. And we also have the 5.5 quart Dutch oven. First and foremost, the unboxing experience. Cause to me, you know, it's all about <laughs> when you get new stuff, how does it make you feel, right? And I can tell you the packaging is beautiful. It makes me feel like, wow, I'm in for a treat, right? We have the Black Lock 1896 uh, logo here on the front. These are beautiful. So let's open the, the skillet first. We got to do the classic first, right? The skillet. So this is our 12 inch cast iron skillet. Um, like I said, it is triple seasoned. It's lighter weight. It's 25% lighter than traditional, uh, their traditional cast iron uh, line. It is guaranteed to cook anything, any way, anywhere for the next hundred years. So one of the great things about cast iron is it goes to all kinds of heat sources, right? You can cook it here on your stove. You can take it to your oven. You can throw it on your barbecue grill. You can throw it directly on a campfire, right? That's how durable it is. And that's what's so great. Or like we did one time, we threw it directly on charcoal, yeah. thousand degrees. Yeah, we put it directly. Eric wanted the ultimate steer on a steak. So he took a giant lodge cast iron, a classic lodge cast iron. He put it directly onto the charcoal on the grill. Got that sucker at like, what? It was, the charcoal was like a thousand. One thousand degrees. degrees and he seared a steak on that bad boy. You can't do that with a lot of other things. Woo! 
Now that is a beauty. My gosh, that's a beauty. Um, so it gives you a little uh, pamphlet here and tells you all about the background of the company. Um, this company was founded in 1863 um, by Joseph Lodge. It gives you a timeline of their uh, company's history, um, gives you all the pieces in the collection. This is, this is beautiful. Tips and care, better with age, how to use it, what the uh, cookware is made out of. Look at that. So they redesigned the handle. They made it a split handle. This is for cooling because it distributes the heat better so the handle doesn't get quite as hot. And look at that, made in the USA. This, my friends, is an absolute beauty. So we can take this plastic thing off. Um, one of the things about this new black lock is it has a better finishing to it. A little bit more care is taken with the finishing because it is a premium product. And then it is triple seasoned. This is beautiful. This is absolutely gorgeous. So now for the Dutch oven. This is a 5.5 quart Dutch oven. And you can make stews in here, roasts, all kinds of stuff. I can tell you, I really can tell um, about the triple seasoning because it is, it ha it's just, it's fantastic. Um, look at that, the little logo's on there. It says Black Lock, um, South Pittsburgh, Tennessee. Wow. Woo -hoo. Number one, the unboxing experience is amazing on this cookware. That's all I got to say. The unboxing experience is amazing. <laughs> Woo! Oh my gosh. So here's our Dutch oven. Ooh, look at that baby. That is one beautiful Dutch oven. I love the handles. There's a lot of room in here to fit your fingers. Um, again, we have the black lock label on the back, the original lodge. This is the number two. So all of their uh, pieces have a number so you can tell the size of it by the number that's on the bottom. Um, holy moly. <laughs> Is it possible to be in love with some cast iron? Sure. <laughs> I'm already in love with it. Oh my gosh, it's beautiful. So cooks, we have two pieces of this beautiful black lock in the Amy Learns to Cook Kitchen. I just want to thank the Pigeon Forge Lodge Factory Store for sending these. We had a fantastic time when we went down there. If you are ever through that area of Tennessee near Pigeon Forge, I would highly recommend you stop in to the Pigeon Forge store. It was so much fun and the people there are, they're amazing. Um, and I really appreciate this. We're gonna give this cast iron it's run for its money, right? Eric is going to get a, one of those ribeye steaks that he cut out of that whole ribeye, and we're going to put one of those babies on here. We're probably going to do a reverse steer. We're going to start it off in the oven, cook it till it's almost done, and then we're going to cook it in a rip-roaring uh, black lock skillet, right, to test this baby out. Um, I can tell you, I already love this pan. Um, I really appreciate it. If you would like to talk to anybody about cast iron, lodge cast iron, how to cook in it, the new Blacklock line, please give them a call down there at the Pigeon Forge store. They are fantastic. You will love talking to them. They're great people and um, you can place orders right there from their factory store. Um, so once again, Harold, thank you. I really appreciate it. We're going to have a lot of fun with this cookware, so stay tuned.
So what's up, cooks? It's Wednesday. I hope you're having a great week. Um, summer is on its way. The heat is here, right? It's time to get out on your deck, take your lodge cast iron out there and cook you some dinner, right? And have a good time. If you like this video, please subscribe below, leave me a comment and a like, and also visit my website at amylearnstocook.com. You can catch me on social media. If you want to talk about, um, the black lock. If you want to talk about cast iron, come on in to my, uh, Facebook group. Actually, Harold is in that group as well. So if you have any questions, you can ask him in my group. Um, it's facebook.com slash group slash Amy learns to cook. You can also catch me on social media at Pinterest and Twitter at Amy learns to cook and on Instagram. You can catch me at cooking with Amy. Wow. This new cast iron is amazing.